Yeah, I could I could get used to that. That's nice. Oh, there, there's their new car. This is a cell phone. We, we've got the cell phone connected through Bluetooth here in the Genesis, and yeah. we're using the microphone built in the car to talk to you inside the house from the car. Well, usually when you call from somewhere, when you call home like this... Okay, well, that was a busy day using my technological expertise to teach two elderly people how to drive a car again. I don't even remember if I mentioned it last night. I was so tired when I wrapped up that clip. Uh, he did end up going over and buying the Hyundai um, officially. I, I knew he was going to do that. He, just like me, is not the kind of person who can get the ball rolling on things and then just wait a couple months until they carry out. When we get something, usually, when, I, when a Schultz gets something in their head, it gets done pretty quickly. With the exception of my wall that took about a year to repaint. So anyways, he got it on Friday, pretty much drove it home. He had spent like three hours signing all this crap. Um, that took forever at the dealership. So he came home, it was like 8 o'clock by the time he got home. Actually, they didn't stay open late for him, but one of the general managers stayed, I think they closed at 6, and the guy stayed until like 8 to make sure that everything went through. So phenomenal service with Hyundai. Well, we're all really impressed. I called today, since it had been 24 hours, to ask how everything was going, if everything was working, if, they had any, if we had any questions. Um, just really, really, really good support. So we kind of messed around with the car today. There is so much technology in that. And it's pretty cool because about 50% of the technology that that has that they raved about is in this. You know, with parking sensors and all the engine technology, variable valve timing and the Vanos equivalent from Korea and stuff is in there. But we rode around in it a lot today. I drove it for probably a half hour today. I put the 100th mile on the car today. Um, impressions. I am incredibly impressed. The Genesis 4.6 drives exactly like what I would expect an S-Class to drive. It's big, it's comfortable, it's just a soothing amount of power, it's quiet, you don't even feel the engine run. It is not dissing the M5, it is the opposite car the M5 is. The M5 you have to work to drive it, and that's what I love. I love driving, it's an experience. BMW is the ultimate driving machine that you have to work for with the manual transmission, and I like that. I like in essence having to work for the vehicle to get it to do what I want it to do. But the Hyundai, you get in, you can be just stoned or completely you know, you haven't slept in 96 hours, you get in that car, you can drive it so easily, it's so comfortable. Eight gears in that, it's a 4.6 V8, 385 horse. Um, it doesn't feel like 385 horsepower, but of course with him in the car, I'm not about to slam my foot down on it. Uh, but I did put it in manual mode for a little bit. It's still an automatic transmission, it's clunky. When you're in drive and you put your foot down a little bit, it's like two seconds before it drops the gear, just like any automatic transmission car and starts to go. Um, it's just so smooth and the power is very, very, very stable. It feels like it's the same torque all the way through, whereas the M5 just builds steadily from two grand all the way up to six before it starts to drop off or so. Uh, but the technology is awesome. It drives like a dream. It's a great car for him. I love it, but I would never buy one. It's just not the kind of car that I want to get in and just cruise. I don't do that. I like to work for the vehicle. So anyways, before I make this a 10 minute vlog, it's uh, Saturday night about 11.30 maybe closer to 12 now. I'm really tired. Uh, did not get a good night's sleep last night for many reasons, but I'm going to go in now and put this together, get something to drink, and um, get to bed. Tomorrow's supposed to be like 83 degrees, rain all morning, and then just go to clouds in the afternoon. So if the roads dry out, maybe we'll pull the 355 out. I don't know. I want to see that. I want to hear that. Love that car. I want to see it again. And look at this. I finally pulled the Honda in right. My mom always pulls it in and stops like four feet from the wall. Well, I stop about there, and I've never hit a wall with one of these cars. And now, look at all this beautiful room behind the car that I can actually get stuff out of. I wouldn't even have to move the trash can to move the mower, but no, she can't handle that. She leaves it like here. All right, whatever, 488, 489, we're done. Talk to you tomorrow on a nice, warm, cloudy Sunday. Good night.